Hey everybody, welcome back. I wanted to share this recipe with you. This is a fruit salad called Waldorf salad. I actually got introduced to this back in high school at the first job I worked at when I was a cook at a retirement home. And it, I waited like 20 years, over 20 years to try this. It was back in 1998 when I was back in high school, got introduced to this salad. It's a um, really good fruit, one of my favorite fruit salads. And I just thought it it, it really does sound weird, like a weird combination, but it just works. And I didn't re-measure. It's kind of the cook I am. I just kind of throw things, the kind of chef I am. I just kind of throw things together. You can use any kind of apples you want, but Granny Smith apples, green apples are my favorite. So I use Granny Smith apples. I threw in about a tablespoon of lemon juice. That's for flavor. That keeps the apples from browning. Green grapes. You could also use purple grapes. And it's usually made with walnuts. I threw so to, to make sure you toast them first to get rid of that raw walnut flavor. So I threw in some toasted walnuts and some sliced celery, some mayonnaise, and some Cool Whip. Now you could also, some people just use mayonnaise. The original recipe just had mayonnaise. Some people throw in mayonnaise and Greek yogurt. Some people throw in mayonnaise and sour cream. There's a, a lot of substitutions that can be made. And most recipes don't call for, there's different variations, like I said. Most recipes don't call for like raisins or dried cranberries or um, also marshmallows. But I also threw in, to give it, this is the first time I've done it this way. I've uh, normally made the other way without the marshmallows and the dried cranberries. But I threw those in, see how they work this time around and let this, uh, mix this all together. And let it chill. And again, I used mayonnaise and Cool Whip. You could also use you know, mayonnaise and Greek yogurt or sour cream. There's a lot of, or you could just use mayonnaise. You could just use Greek yogurt. You could just use sour cream. And just whatever suits you. There's uh, different variations, different likes and dislikes to this recipe. And this was actually created back in the uh, 1800s at a hotel called Waldorf. And it was, like I said, this is a really, it sounds like a really weird combination, but it just works. Mayonnaise and, I mean, celery with grapes. It just sounds weird. It took me over 20 years to try this, but I'm glad I finally got up the guts to try it. You can serve it just like this or over um, leaf, uh, lettuce leaf lined plate. Put a leaf of lettuce on the plate. You could do that. You could just serve it plain as is. This could be a dessert. It could be, uh, yeah, but usually it's served as an appetizer salad, but it could also be a main dish. It could also be a dessert, and you could also, as a main dish, you could throw a wind or, or on the side have like some baked chicken or grilled chicken, add it to the salad, make it like a chicken fruit salad. So, yeah, whatever suits you and your likes and dislikes. Comment, like, share, subscribe. Uh, let me know what you think of this, and I'll talk to you all real soon with another great video. Have a great rest of your week, everybody. Talk to you all soon. Bye.